Hello everyone, welcome to Site Giant's video tutorial. I'm Catherine and today we'll be talking about how to set up shipping method and apply shipping charges. Once you receive orders, it requires packing and shipping of parcels to your customers. Hence, setting up shipping method is necessary for you to charge shipping fee along with the item price. In Site Giant, there are several shipping methods you can apply. They are flat rate, free shipping, per item, pick up from stars, with base shipping and with base shipping too. To install shipping method, you will need to go to setting and select shipping. Want to add shipping method? Click add shipping here. Most of the shipping methods have this common field to fill out. Title is the name displayed at checkout page. Cost is the shipping charge. Zero zone is the area applied for that particular shipping method. You can customize zero zone to charge different shipping fee. And remember to enable the status to apply on your site giant store. Flat rate is a fixed shipping charge regardless of quantity and weight, usually for merchants who sell products that do not have much difference in weight. This is how you set up flat rate shipping. You can add flat rate here. If you want to amend details, click on the title. Fill in the title, cost, zero zone to charge flat rate, enable the status, and done. Here is a sample I charge two different flat rate for West and East Malaysia. Remember to enable this status too and save. Moving on to free shipping, we have two types of free shipping, product based and total amount based. Product based is a free shipping given to a particular product, whereas total amount based is a free shipping provided based on the total amount in order achieved. Bear in mind that you can only activate one type of free shipping at a time. For total amount base, the total here is the minimum ordered amount entitled for free shipping. If you wish to display free shipping option only and hide other shipping methods including pickup from stores and checkout if customers entitled for it, enable show only free shipping and save. For product based free shipping, select product base instead. As usual, fill in the title, status and still zone. Then choose from categories and select the product that you would like to offer free shipping and add. After adding the product, click save button on top right. The third shipping method is per item. This shipping charge depends on order quantity. The cost I inserted is 20 ringgit. Therefore, if customers purchase two items from my stores, they will have to pay 40 ringgit for shipping. Next, pick up from store. Enable it if you have a retail shop and allow your customers to self collect. Next, I will talk about weight based shipping and weight based shipping too. They are calculated based on the total weight of the product purchase. Therefore, product weight must be entered in order for this to work. The differences between them are the method of calculation. Weight based shipping is calculated based on custom weight ranges. Whereas weight based shipping 2 is calculated based on the base fee for certain weight and additional fee for additional weight. Let me show you how to set up weight based shipping. Add weight here. The formula of inserting the rate is weight colon cost. For example, I would like to charge 0 to 1 kilogram for 8 ringgit, 1 to 3 kilogram for 15 ringgit, and 3 to 5 kilogram for 30 ringgit. Ignore the first digit of weight and insert 1 colon 8 comma 3 colon 15 comma 5 colon 30. The percentage is the additional charge on top of the predefined weight. After done all the setting, enable the status and done. Usually merchant would set two weight weights as they have different shipping charges for West and East Malaysia. Let's talk about the last manual shipping method, web based shipping tool. You may find this available charges as it has been configured by post Laju rates for your reference. Let's take post Laju for an instance. Here is the post Laju rate I found from its website. Post Laju has categorized the charges into two groups. One is below 2 kg and another one is 2 kg to 30 kg. To ship within Peninsular Malaysia, Sabah or Sarawak, let's focus on Zone 2. For item below 2 kg, the first 0.5 kg is 5 ringgit and 40 cents, and subsequent 0.25 kg is 1 ringgit. 
Therefore, you will need to set a range from 0.001 to 2.00. While for the following setting, first weight insert 0.500, price for first weight insert 5.40, and repeating next weight insert 0.250. Price for repeating next week, insert 1.00. As for additional fee charge, please insert 25 because Post Lightroom will have 15% fuel surcharge and 10% handling charges. Besides that, they also have 6% SSD. Therefore, you will need to add 6 here at additional fee charge 1. Done. Enable the status and save. Same goes to 30 kg range for Within Peninsula, Malaysia, Sabah and Sarawak. Feel free to go through all this setting and adjust the charges based on your preference. Before setting up any of the above shipping method, kindly get shipping rates from your courier service provider and find the most suitable shipping method to apply. Most merchants will choose free shipping total amount bids because this will encourage your customers to buy more in order to be eligible for free shipping. Besides that, merchants will also set up baby shipping 1 and 2 because this is to charge shipping fee on those orders that are not entitled for free shipping. If you have international shipping, you may set per item shipping method. This is the end of our shipping method tutorial. Thanks for watching this. We hope this tutorial gives you some idea to choose and select your shipping method in Site Giant Store. If you have further enquiries, feel free to refer to our knowledge page at support.sitegiant.my or contact us at live chat or email to support at sitegiant.my. Goodbye and have a great day!